Yo, what's up guys? Java Brothers here, where we teach, inspire, and motivate first-time filmmakers to make their first feature film. Yeah, buddy. Right. So we had a question that somebody messaged us and asked us. Um, what is the question? Brian has it up. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and read what he said. He said, good morning. Um, uh, I have a comedy screenplay. Um, it basically tells a little bit about it. Um, I would like to sell or turn into a movie through your company. How would I go about pitching my script? I would love to be a comedy writer for your company or industry. Um, so, just to touch on it a little bit. Um, first of all, try not to rely on others to make your, your, your projects come through. Um, we were talking about this earlier. Write with what you have, okay? Make something that you can make now with your local people and start building a resume. Now, I don't know what this guy has done. I don't know what projects he's done. If he's done a feature film, my guess is he probably hasn't. Um, he's just submitting his stuff. He didn't send a script over or submit it the right way, um, which you can go to our website and, and submit anything to us. Because we do look at scripts. We are looking for projects. Um, typically, we're not into comedy too much. We're not the Cohen brothers, we're the Jalbert brothers. Um, and we do more thriller, horror, action, I would say, kind yeah. of that realm, yeah. you know? Uh, but stop trying to go after people to make your stuff come true. You gotta make it yourself. You gotta go after it yourself, you know? Think as an entrepreneur. That's, that's, that, that would be my best advice as a filmmaker nowadays. Don't be more than just a filmmaker, okay? Yeah. Be an entrepreneur. Um, build something from the ground up. Okay, start small, think big. Cause you might, I mean, you might find other passions. <clears throat> you might go through this process, making your, making your movie, you might love it. You might be like, oh, I enjoy directing. Then you can write scripts and direct and produce them. Yeah. Um, so don't wait around. Don't wait for someone else to pick up your script and make it. You go make it. Even if it ain't gonna be the best or the budget maybe you want, go do that, get that start. Um, <clears throat> you can always remake it later. Make it better, make it the way you want to, but just get started, go for it. Therefore, people can actually see your script on the screen. Um, and you have more, more leverage to pitch your script. Say, oh, I wanna do this the right way. You guys, and somebody might find interest in that if you, you know, send it to a film festival or however you distribute it. <clears throat> they might see it and be like, I like this, I wanna kinda remake this, this would be cool. So, that's what I would say, man. Same thing Brian was saying, just go do it, you know? Go do it yourself, make the script. And you might be like, oh, I don't know how to do that. Well, you gotta look into it. It's gonna be tough, but you gotta go do it. And one of the reasons I say that too is because we were in the music industry and we were in it for 10 years, okay? And our biggest goal was we were gonna get picked up and signed by a record label and make it. We did get picked up, we did get signed, but we didn't make it because we didn't have a right plan in place to succeed, okay? If we would have bootstrapped it ourselves, built a company around us, we would have had a better shot of controlling the outcome. That's what I want you guys to try to do. You know, don't ask us for help. We're giving you information to help you, you know? If I do see something that piques my interest, a script that comes along or a project, I will definitely respond back and, and say, hey, this is pretty cool. Like, let's, let's look into this a little more. But not every project's gonna peak everybody. That might be for somebody else. And, and also, I would touch on that, <clears throat> would be, don't more or less say, hey, I have a script I want you guys to produce. You know, maybe ask us, hey, is there anything you're looking for? I'm a script writer, is there anything you're looking for that maybe I can write to confine for you guys? Like, hey, is there anything that I can write for you? Is there anything I can do for you? Yeah. I'll be more posed, oh, this is cool, okay. Maybe not at first, maybe we might be working on other projects right now. Um, but follow up. Follow up, you know, in two, three months, six months. Hey, how you guys been? Um, I'm the guy that sent you the comedy script. Is there anything I can do for you? Any scripts I can write for you? Um, you know, it goes back to adding value. We've done a video on that. Yeah, and stay in contact, like he was saying, stay in contact with people that you've built relationships up with or that you're just trying to maybe work with because you may come at them at the wrong time. They may be so busy, don't even look at it. But if you stay in contact and you keep sending them something or keep calling or just every now and then reach out to them, you might hit them at the right time and they look at it and they see it and for some reason on that day, it's like, ah, yeah, I like this. I wanna talk more about this. So you might catch them at the right time. 
and you might also catch him at the wrong time. So keep pushing, okay? But don't, but don't wait. But don't wait, yeah. Because we might not ever make your film. We might not ever help you, you know? <clears throat> no offense to you. No, we don't know you, you know? We do these talks and give this advice to help you guys, you know? We're trying to give you guys knowledge and things that can help you further your career. So that's what I would say, man. Go do it. Go make the movie yourself. Even if you got to make it on a shoe, shoestring budget, yeah. 500 bucks, 1,000 bucks, whatever. Go make a comedy script. Go do it, man. Show people that you're willing to take those leaps. That's what it's about. It's about proving, you know, proving your concept, proving that your comedy script is what it is. And there's no beta, better way to do that than do it yourself. Because also, when you start getting other people involved and other producers involved, they want to change stuff. They're going to want to change stuff and kind of make it their own, too. And you may not agree with that, you know, but they're putting up the money. What do you do? And do you blame them if it's bad? Do you say, oh, man, it was because the producer got involved? Really? So, I mean, you need to take it upon yourself to make your own project, guys. The gear is there. I mean, it's the best time to be making films to get your story across. And the worst times, because anybody can do it. So, get out there. Make your project. It may not be perfect, but it's yours. I mean, that's, that's what I feel. Yeah, for sure, man. 100%. So, hopefully, in <clears throat> getting over cold here. Hopefully in six months or so, you will be working on that project. So please email us back when you do. I hope you do, and I hope you succeed at it, my friend. Yeah, man. Hit us back when you make it, because we want to see it. That's what we like. That's success right there. Make your own success. <laughs>